It's a portal. We're going through it. Oh, what's going on, everybody? Z here, and welcome back to some more Starfield today. Ooh, we are heading to a place that uh, has a large spike in artifact activity and uh, i don't know i don't know we'll see we'll see what happens hopefully you're all having a wonderful day i'm having a fantastic day now i am going to uh going from here i think starting from here i think we're gonna get we're getting to kind of a little bit of rep a repetitive loop here um i think we're gonna start cutting a little bit more and i'm just gonna be kind of doing some highlight clips and i think that's just to basically you know keep things a little bit more interesting than, than the last couple of videos have been so uh yeah hopefully you guys enjoy if you do like subscribe all the fun things but let's further without further ado let's get into um Let's get into it, shall we? So let's go into missions here. And we need to go to main missions into the unknown. Uh, we're going to go here. Let's go ahead and set our course. And let's see. Are we doing? No, this is what is this? Hold on. That is not scanner anomaly. OK, so that is what we are here for. All right. So we're going to go ahead and land there and then uh, we're doing some on foot exploration. So yeah, hopefully, uh, hopefully we'll find something cool. Oh, I love, I love the, uh, I love the landing sequence of like landing on planets, but at the same time, oh, I don't think it'll ever get old. <laughs> I love it too much. I really do. It's really cool. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and exit the ship and we need to, uh, we're going to have to do some scanning and stuff like that. Open the hand scanner and look for distortions in your field of view. Follow the distortions to the source. Okay, so looking for distortions. So we have an unknown thing over there. We got an unknown thing over there. What does it mean by a distortion in my field of view? Oh my gosh, what is that? I want to scan it. Oh, those are not nice. Already, I know they're not nice. Look at how, look at how nasty they look. Oh. The distortion on the 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 ring itself. See how the ring itself is like kind of messing up. Oh, okay. We got we got something going. Oh, toxic gas. Okay, let's be careful of the toxic gas. What was that? Hearing crabify gazer grazer. Oh, hunting shield shell. Okay. Uh, I have a feeling this might not be. Uh, this guy, well, maybe not. Hold on. Okay, we're gonna get, we're gonna get, um, ooh, what do we get out? What do we get out here? Uh, we get out this, no, we're not getting out the tombstone. All right, we'll get out this bad boy. Um, I wanna scan this. Oh, okay. He actually doesn't seem to be that upset. Um, okay. I lied. Oh, my health is like gone already. Oh my gosh. Okay. What happens when you die the first time? <laughs> Holy moly. I wasn't expecting that like at all. Uh, okay. Wow. Maybe I should go ahead and heal up first. Uh, these guys are level 15 though. That one is. That one's only level 10. Should we try to take them out now? No. Well, you know what? Why not? Okay. That one's gone. If we might as well take him out from a distance, you know what I'm saying? The only thing I don't like about having the scanner out is that it doesn't appear that you can have the uh, your weapon out either at the same time. Oh, what the heck are those thing? Look at those things. Those are cool. All right, this is this is actually really cool. This is uh, use the hand scanner to place. Wait, what? An outpost beacon. Outpost. What are we gonna play? Are we gonna build an outpost here? Place an outpost beacon by pressing E. Hold on. Somebody's coming over here. <gasps> Placing an outpost beacon allows you to build objects and structures, navigating uh, the build menu categories using Q and E. Switch to modify. Mo oh my gosh, we're building a base for the very first time ever. <laughs> yes. Outpost objects are built from items and resources when building uh, an object. The build costs are automatically removed from your ship's cargo hold or your inventory. I don't know what this is. What is this thing? Uh, extractor argon extractor um the extractor argon requires power in order to function build a power station from the power category okay um well i didn't mean to i didn't actually mean to build that so i don't have anything to build anything else now uh i need nickel i would have rather had water 
than argon but i mean i guess it is what it is okay so c and z hold on so we have extractors uh scan booster landing pad small oh my gosh that's a small landing pad are you kidding me no way let's hold on okay so do we have a toggle view <gasps> uh the fly cam uh view of your outpost can be an easier way to build large structures you can freely switch between the first person and the fly cam okay oh that is nice that is nice okay so we've got some thing we got some creatures there that is huge okay can i zoom out no landing pad with ship builder that is massive okay hold on where's my uh wait where's my where's my thing where's the hold on how do i get back to uh i don't even know where where did i where did my stuff go hold on let's go back to toggle view okay okay so there's that right there should we just build this let's just build it to build it let's just do it okay that's built so what else do we have um scan booster displays decorations furniture defenses crafting structures okay see this is what we need i need to get like an outpost uh thing going here we have a little bit of stuff so hold on what do we have four wall hab a hydroponic hab so i'm guessing this is for um this is for oh a science hab four wall hab round hab military outpost airlock hallway okay well should we do like um so there's hold on let's let's try to get this figured out here a little bit is there a um is there a grid modify mode no variance q and t science have flat oh there's like a there's like a oh okay flat small and small all right we're gonna go ahead and place it right here so that's a small lab oh wait it didn't oh it didn't place oh i'm trying to get it like lined up with this kind of here we go and confirm okay and then can we do a hydroponic thing on the side here and then let's do an outpost airlock on this guy right here maybe okay hold on this is a little oh oh your mouse okay so forward on the mouse okay cool here we go here we go we're figuring this out cannot place intersects with an existing object are you kidding me interesting can we do a hallway and then a hab or and then an airlock maybe oh i'm out of seal it now how can i i can't even get in now oh no i can't even get into the place oh no okay and then we also have transfer container storage solid storage liquid storage gas uh solar array oh well we don't have any room we don't oh yeah we do okay so let's do uh i guess maybe something like right here we'll build that there a fueled generator we don't have anything for that powered switch Okay, so we got a solar array, which is unfortunate because it's not, it's not even light out here. <laughs> it's uh, whatever. It is what it is. Okay, so I need some sealant. And there's like interior stuff, um, a basic turret, pride with power. Um, I mean, I feel like if we're going to have a turret, it should be guarding the base. You know what I'm saying? I don't even know. We're going to place it down right there, though. Wait, maybe we're not. Yes, we are. All right, turret is down. Okay, so now uh, let's get into, so we need power. Total power is four. Oh, shoot so we would need another solar array possibly now do we have to connect them or do they like connect on their own need power eight total power eight crew zero cargo zero production 0.55 per minute because we're making an argon thing i guess i don't know you've powered your first okay um i don't have sealant though is the problem so hold on, let's get let's uh toggle view let's escape so this is all cool and all. However, uh, I, <laughs> I don't have any sealant. Now, can the frontier land on this thing? I'm actually kind of curious. Can I call my ship in here? No. Oh, no, it doesn't look like it. Okay, this is interesting. So we're making Argon. Is that what's going on in here? Hold to open. I, I took an Argon, I guess. I want to get in there. Okay, so we need to, we need to get some sealant, which unfortunately I don't have. Um, and we need to like craft up some stuff. Let's see what the mission wants us to do now. Okay, follow distortions on the scanner. You know what? It was probably, I could probably build that anywhere. 
and I just made it out to an area that I was able to build a um, like that. I probably made it to one of those areas and it was like, okay, you can build here. And it was just telling me I can build here. Oh yeah. See, like, look at now there's, okay. So hold on. Look at this yellow line. There's yellow lines like everywhere now too. Interesting. Okay. So it wasn't part of the, okay. So we get We did a little bit of base building. We'll have to figure that. We'll have to come back and figure this out. Um, I'll probably make a, I'm going to make a whole thing dedicated on that. But we need to follow the, uh, we need to follow these weird things. Oh, see, like, there's another... That must be a building site. See, like, what is... What, what, why is that? That's so weird. I don't know what the deal is with that. Oh. Okay, we're getting some, we're getting some serious interference now. Can I scan you? Don't attack me. Please don't attack me. I don't want to die. Oh yeah, we're getting real good interference now. Okay, where are we going? We were getting real good interference. Maybe this thing? It's almost like a meteor crash or something right here. Oh yeah, this is definitely, so there's definitely something over here. Oh, investigate the source of, whoa, what the heck? Oh, there's a huge structure. What in the heck is that? Uh, I would say we found something. Temple? Eta. Oh my gosh. It's a thing. We found a thing. Okay. We're going into this super mysterious thing. We're going to, oh, it's opening for us. Oh, it's opening for us. Let's touch it. Protection regen. What? We're all floaty. <gasps> There's the ring right there. That's a full ring. That's what we're finding. No way. Okay. Do we, do we touch the ring? Oh, there's a thing right there. I don't even know what's happening here. I feel like we should touch it. Oh, it wants me to, it wants me to go to find these things. It's telling me how to float. Or, okay. It told me to how to float around. This is insane. I don't know what's going on here. Oh, it's going faster and faster every time. Oh my gosh. What if it's like a teleportation thing? Oh my gosh, the music is amazing. I don't even know what's happening. How many do we have to do? I don't know. I don't see any more. Oh, yep. There's one right there. <gasps> what? It's a portal. It's a portal. We're going through it. We just became microwaved. Oh my gosh. Wait, why did I wake up out here? <gasps> to equip your new power? Press tab and open the data menu. What? What? Anti-gravity field? Seven undiscovered temples. Cost 45 power, total 60 power. Generate a localized field of intense low gravity and behold a planet's true power. Toggle power names. Okay, it's active. Oh my gosh. Press Z to use your new power. Are you kidding me? No way. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? That is like I literal, literal chills. Literal chills that is so cool um i don't even know like what to do here that is so cool oh <gasps> that is so cool okay what is this um do we oh my gosh so we need to find more of these temples now is it was that okay so was that it for the mission like was that all all I was supposed to do here 
Return to the lodge. Oh, guys, I got these new powers. Check them out. <gasps> oh, that's super cool. Okay, so I think I'm going to actually go back to... Uh, I actually want to go back to my uh, my little settlement deal and see if I can't deconstruct it because <laughs> this isn't exact... Oh, wow, I have hypothermia. Fantastic. This isn't exactly where... You know what? This isn't even what I needed to do, is it? Wait, where am I going? Where is my ship? We already went there. Okay, so it must be it must be back over here. Yeah, there's my ship right there. Okay. So we're going to go back over this way. I'm going to see if I can deconstruct my base. Just because this isn't like a planet that I want it on. <laughs> as nice as it is, this isn't it. Ooh, those hunting things killed all of these. Which actually is actually fine because I think we actually need this for stuff anyways. Uh oh. This big one right there. You know what though? If he comes over near me, I'm just gonna use my powers. I don't, I'm gonna, you know what? I'm gonna use my powers on him anyways. Guess what? Oh no, you're all floaty. What in the heck is going on? Wow, he's got a lot of health. Ooh, I'm glad we took that guy out when we did. Uh, okay, hold on, let's actually scan. Oh, we're done scanning. We're gonna take this stuff. So some of this stuff can be used for something. I don't know what it is, but uh, <laughs> oh, that was cool. That was cool. Like that was pretty cool. Can't wait to use it on like a people per like a, a people enemies. <gasps> That's gonna be so much fun. Oh, I went through a toxic thing. Darn it. Lung damage now. Oh man. I just got special powers, but I can't. <laughs> I can't deal with the cold. <sighs> All right, I'm gonna see if I can. Uh, I'm gonna see if I can take this down. If I go in, if I can interact with this guy, remove outpost. Removing an outpost is permanent procedural removal. Yes. Did we get the stuff back though? That's my question. I don't know. I don't really. I'm not really worried about it because the stuff that I had, I just collected uh, for funsies. Oh, now I have frostbite too. Mm, wonderful. I have frostbite, lung damage, and hypothermia. Uh, feeling real great here. Uh, protection and regen, but do we... We're going to need something. But it actually looks like it's healing. All right, so we got to go show... We got to show our constellation friends our new abilities. I mean, come on. What are they going to say? It's like, hey, guys, I went to this thing. Lots of lights floating around. And, um, well, now I'm a god. So... <laughs> I don't know. Let's see what happens. I'm so I'm actually really curious to see what these uh, what's gonna happen here. Okay. Oh, everybody's waiting for me. Hey guys. Craig's bones. Look at you. Look at you. What about? If you don't mind, I'm gonna start doing some scans, like right now. Wait, how did you guys know? We were right about the anomaly, weren't we? Uh huh. Tip our ears on the tail. It was a building, like a temple. It gave me powers. What in the blackest sea are you going on about? What did it do to you? Um, Vladimir, look at these readings. Cardiovascular and neurological levels aren't in the normal range. No. Nope. I think we're going to need a little demonstration. Mind putting the paces to it? Oh, absolutely. Uh, yeah, here you go. Uh, enjoy, guys. There you go. Everyone saw that, right? Uh, it's still going on. Like a literal gift from the heavens. <laughs> and also the most practical consequence of our little venture thus far. Got no old shipwise for this one. Going to just call weird, weird. Okay. It was a temple that did this. I'm going to use this everywhere. <laughs> so we have artifacts, a temple, and this power all connected. Can we find more of them? I'm All sure we can. One up from the <gasps> Matches another one of the artifacts we found. Let's do it. In theory, there might be one temple for each. But sifting through all the signs to identify a match is tricky. Impossible if we don't have the right artifact to compare. And even then, it takes time. Uh, I'll follow up on the other anomaly you found. Hopefully it's another temple. Don't think it's just fortune's left that this temple responded to you. The artifacts, the visions, this power you've gotten, all seems to be the same song somehow. Oh, absolutely. Plenty to think about. Anyway, catch a smile out there. 
I'll work on finding planet anomalies that match the other artifacts we have. Okay, so each artifact has a chance to be a temple, maybe? Oh, that's so cool. Power from beyond, baby. Let's go. Okay. So, um, what are we going to do? Acquire the power on Sirius 1. So, uh, that sounds like a fantastic idea. I think I we're just going to... You are satisfied with the quarters available to you. Um, I did, I've never even gone to look at the quarters. And honestly, thanks. But uh, we've got... We got some things to do. So I do want to actually, I want to talk about one thing uh, in into, oh wait, hold on. Oh, that's not a main mission. That's a side mission. Okay, well let's do, uh, so it must be miscellaneous. Oh wow, so that's not even, a, okay, so this is our main mission. Um, Let's go, uh, let's go, we gotta go get the other power. I mean, come on, like real, you, we gotta do it. Um. One thing I, I'm, I'm kind of like touching with here that I'm not 100% sure, but like all the, I don't know how much I think that the travel system was 100% correct for the game. I like it as a player because just popping back and forth. And I honestly, I think that's probably what it was, but it, it almost feels a little easy. You know what I'm saying? Like it almost feels almost too easy to get from place to place, if that makes sense. So um, I'm sure maybe in the future, maybe I'll be going, you know, because we did have to do an initial thing like one time, like we had to do it ourselves one time, um, getting from place to place. But I don't know, like I almost feel like it's a little too easy, but at the same time, I also can understand that maybe you don't want to spend like all of your time in space and like, you know, just getting from point A to point B because space is huge. Like the, the whole like, you know, thing of like, oh, uh, you know, trying to get it to scale is, is insane. Um, so yeah, you know, I just want to I just want to put that out there because I, I think some people are gonna say it's too easy to get from point A to point B. Um, I think people are there's the temple right there. <laughs> I think people are gonna say some things about it. And I just wanted to, I just wanted to let you guys know. Um, oh, there's like artifacts everywhere. There's an artifact hovering right there. <gasps> what is this? Oh my gosh! Let's go! Let's go! This place looks cool. What is that? See, there's something there. There's something. Oh, this would be a cool place to build. Extreme solar radiation. Oh. Wow. Which way? Sh uh oh. Oh no! Did somebody just land right behind me? Somebody's landing over there. Okay, there's the temple right there. I can see it from here. All right, we're going to the temple. We're gonna go. We're gonna go get another. Uh, we're gonna try to get it. Well, we're gonna try to get another power. You know what's what's weird is like my my scope looks red. Oh, it's because it's scanning. That's why. Oh, this is cool. This is cool. I have to say that I am thoroughly enjoying the planets thus far. I have not done a little, I haven't, we haven't done a lot of um, exploration per se on our own. We've kind of been just um, following what we were supposed to be doing, you know, but it seems so far that the planets are very cool. They're very neat. They're very different some of them i mean obviously barren planets are gonna be barren planets so that's gonna be what it is but okay how do we get in here can we scan this okay show resources we must be going in right here it's right here somewhere oh here we go is this it oh it's like right there wait a second <laughs> it's it's not right here Hold on, maybe we can run to the other side. No. Oh, we're close, but not quite. I went the wrong way somewhere. Took a wrong turn in Albuquerque. Darn it. Okay, here we go. Ah, yeah, it wanted me to go right in here. Got it. Let's get another power, shall we? Here we go. Magical door open again for us. Two powers in one. Well, you know what? We haven't got the other power yet. It might not let us get this other power yet. Or it might. I have no idea. Okay, here we go. So another little mini game of collecting the bubbles. All right, where's the, there we go. We just got to collect a bunch of these to speed it up. Oh, it's ready. Okay, it looks like maybe you don't have to do quite as many. All right, here we go. Let's go, let's do it, let's do it. 
Oh my gosh, that's so cool! I love it. Okay, what next? What's our next thing that we're getting here? Oh, is that I end up here? Okay. Uh, personal atmosphere. Is that what I unlocked? Okay, so if I go into here, failure to communicate, mission updated. Uh oh. All right, anti gravity field, personal atmosphere, oxygen, pure and clean, brought forth to breathe deep and counteract harmful carbon dioxide. Oh, so this will. Okay, so if we select that, now for me on talk to uh, Vladimir to locate the temple. It's a new mission. Okay, so if we say do, let's. Okay, hold on, let's run. We're gonna go over here. I wanna run till we get a uh, carbon dioxide buildup and I wanna see if that is, so basically it might allow us to keep running or maybe also, I don't know. What does it give us like a little bubble? I have a cough. All right, so hold on, let's get let's get the CO2 buildup. Okay, so CO2 is building up. Now, if I do, aha, it gives me my O2 all back. Oh, and it looks like it makes like a little, a little bubble around me for a little bit. Oh, and I can keep running. Indefinitely while it's going. Oh, that is so cool. That is very, very cool. I like that. Okay, hold on. I want to see this uh, mission failure to communicate. Did it just come updated? Okay, cool. I was a little bit worried about uh, if like if I started the mission, if I only had so long to finish it, but I'm hoping that that's not the case. I don't really like timed missions like that. Or if it is timed, like where I'll at least tell you that it's timed. You know what I'm saying? So that would be nice. Um, okay, let's pop out of here. Let's board and then let's head back and uh, let's talk about our new power once again. <laughs> Two powers in one time. This one, I don't know. I think, leave a comment, let me know. What do you think? Which is your uh, power choice? Um, this is this would be good for I feel like exploring and stuff like that. Anti gravity field though, like that's really cool. Like come on, that's really cool. <laughs> I don't know. Um, it says we have six undiscovered temples. So does that mean we have one there? One is each one of these dots a power? And it means that we have six temples right now that we can find because we found six pieces and each temple's a piece. So that might be what it's saying right now. I'm not 100% sure. Vlad, Vlad, my man, my man, I got a new ability. Tell me you have more temples for me to go to. I mean, I'm sick, but that is completely besides the point. Never hey. regretted coming out of retirement. Constellations got the writ of the righteous. Yep. Keeps me young. Okay. Hey. Up my room in the lodge, so um, so powers home. pretty neat, right? Everyone stretches the mind to the far ends. Not sure neat is the word. Not sure neat is the word. Heart stopping might be closer to the mark. Might be closer to the mark. <laughs> oh man, come on, be happy for me. Um, I'm just making light of the situation. Won't put the faults to you there. When you're outside, all known understanding of how things work. Best to keep smiling. All right. Um, now do you anyway, have? We'll be with you as we all figure what this means. Artifacts sure keep being a showboat of surprises. Yeah, they do. All right, I was hoping you put me into the net. Found one. Oh. Easy as a needle in the stack. Hope those powers you're getting to overinflate you. Got enough eagles in Constellation. Okay. Acquire the power from Volley Epsilon. <laughs> Oh my gosh, this is so exciting. But that's going to end this episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, like, subscribe, all the fun things. The next episode, I mean, I guess we're going to be getting some more uh, powers going. We definitely need to run through these powers as quick as we... I, I feel like there's no reason to not get them if they're available. And like I said, I almost feel like the... Um, I almost feel like if it says six undiscovered temples and we are at number five... I If each one of these dot is a, dots is a power, we've recovered six pieces, right? One, two... We did the one there, we did two there, and they already had a couple. So if maybe every time we get a new fragment, then we can go get a new temple and a new power. You know what I'm saying? Like they kind of go hand in hand. So I want to get these done. I, this is what I'm guessing anyways. I don't know for sure. Uh, get these done so we're caught up and then we can basically keep them from one for one uh, going along the future. Also, I might be doing, I might also go ahead and do some side missions in order to get my level up a little bit. 
because I feel like maybe um, with the with some things becoming uh, higher level, I, I want to make sure that my level is uh, like, you know, on par as well, because I don't know if I also don't know if um, weaponry is level based or not. So I can see like we're starting to get some more weapons that do a little bit more damage. And I don't know if these are like, you know, level based or not. So the higher level we are, the maybe the better, better weapons we get, the higher, higher damage they'll be. I imagine they will be because as we get higher level enemies, they're going to be harder to kill. So we're going to need better weapons. So, um, but yeah, thanks again for coming out. Have an absolutely fantastic rest of your day. Leave a comment. Let me know. Are you playing Starfield? And, uh, what do you think of the powers? Leave, leave, let me know which one so far is your favorite. And, uh, I'm ready for the next ones. I'm ready to see what we got, but thanks again. Have a wonderful day. I'll see you in the next one. Bye everybody.